Ordi. I can't wait to see what this city has to offer. Jerry. I just hope we don't get lost in the labyrinth of hallways. Yeah, I love it. What is it? It's a painting of an eagle. Weren't eagles extinct a few centuries ago? No, eagles are still around. You should see one in person. Huh. Hey Jerry, check this out. What is it? It's an eagle. Weren't eagles extinct a few centuries ago? No, eagles are still around. You should see one in person. Wow, that's really gorgeous. Yeah, I love art. Hey, not so much. I'm a simple man with no clue about art. Ordi, your dad is pretty uneducated about art, but he loves you and that's all that matters. Yeah, I'd love to see that in a movie. You guys are so into your sci-fi strats. What's the deal? Oh, just wondering about different scenes and how they could work in a movie. Oh, I see. So you're thinking of directing one day? Hey, maybe. Who knows? But for now, we're just enjoying our sci-fi adventures. That's true, Morty. You and Rick are always so into your gear and your adventures. It's nice to see a different side to you guys. What do you think, Morty? I think it's cool, Rick. It's like a mix of old and new. That's how I feel about our sci-fi adventures. We mix old and new elements to make something new and exciting. I always love a good adventure, Morty. And seeing new places and meeting new people is always a blast. That's why I love traveling in space. Yeah, I totally get that. It's amazing what we can learn from different parts of the universe. Exactly, Jerry. And I always love sharing the fruits of our adventures with Morty. He's such a good friend. Yep, yeah, we just always have so much fun together, Rick. Thanks for always being there for me. You're welcome, Morty. I'm glad we can always have such a positive and happy relationship. This painting is amazing. I love the way they depict the guitars and the red background. It gives the painting a really cool sci-fi vibe. Thanks, Daddy. I love playing the hero. True, Morty, and you, dear lady, have the look of a sci-fi heroine. Lady. Oh, thank you. I've always loved sci-fi. Me too, Morty. Me too. That's a good picture, Morty. Yeah, it is. I love the way the colors look together. Yeah, they do look good. I have no clue what that has to do with anything.
Dude, check out the detail in that painting. It's amazing. Yeah, I love the way it depicts a woman with style and class. Hmm. I don't know about that. To me, it just looks like somebody drew a picture of a toilet. What are you guys talking about? We're just analyzing this picture of a cartoon character with a tongue sticking out of his mouth and a fire in the background with a sky background. Wild E. Coyote. Is that a picture of a cartoon character with a tongue sticking out of his mouth and a fire in the background with a sky background? Wild E. Coyote? That's the picture, Morty. Oh, I see. You guys are talking about the cartoon character with a tongue sticking out of his mouth and a fire in the background with a sky background, Wild E. Coyote. Rick and Yep. Well, I've never seen that cartoon character before, but I've definitely heard of him. His name is Wild E. Coyote, and he's a famous character in the world of cartoons. Rick and Yep, we know. He's an iconic character in the world of cartoons, Morty. Are you saying that Wild E. Coyote is a famous character in the world of sci-fi, Rick? Yep, Morty. Wild E. Coyote is definitely a famous character in the world of sci-fi. Wow, that's interesting. I can't say I've ever heard of him before, but I've definitely heard of him. He's definitely an iconic character in the world of sci-fi. So Morty, do you like sci-fi? Heck yay! I love the whole concept of traveling to different planets and meeting new alien lifeforms. It's just so exciting. Yeah, me too Morty. I always look forward to our adventures. This is a beautiful photo, Morty. What you think? It's amazing, Rick. The colors and the details are fantastic. I couldn't agree more, Morty. And the Asari in the picture. She's so beautiful. Yeah, the Asari are some of the coolest aliens in that game. You're right, Rick. They're really badass. Thanks, Rick. This is an interesting picture, Morty. It looks like a woman from a future in which I have fought a war with the Quarians. It's an exciting time to be a space cowboy. Yeah, I love the design of their suits. I always wondered why their ships had those three red tendrils coming out of them. I always imagined it was because they were sacrificing themselves to protect the galaxy. Morty, I thought you were supposed to be drawing a picture of your daydream. Eh, hey, whatever. I'm just happy Rick is happy today. That's a really good picture, Morty. It's got a really cool perspective. Yeah, I think it's a cool picture, Rick. It's got a great perspective. Yeah, I think it's a great picture, Morty. It's got a great perspective. Probably not. We'll just have to find out, Morty. Hey, kids. What's going on? Jerry, we're analyzing this cool picture. Cool. What do you think it means? I'm not sure. 
but it looks like it could be a teaser for an upcoming sci-fi adventure. Oh, I see. Well, good luck with that. I'm just a simple man with no clue about art. Whoa, that's amazing. Did you draw that? No, nah, my buddy Diego did it. Diego, he's a great artist. Yeah, he's really good. I can't believe you got Diego to do that. This is an amazing picture. I love the colors and the composition. Yeah, it's really good. It's got a really nice vibe to it. Yeah, I think so too. It's like a painting. That's right, Rick. A painting. He's got a really cool science five 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 five. Too bad I don't know how to paint like that. You could always learn, Dad. Maybe I will. Thanks, Morty. Hee <laughs> hee. Sure thing, Rick. Dude, that's our enemy. Enemy of what? The enemy of happiness. But what does this have to do with our sci-fi adventure? Everything. See, our enemies are always trying to ruin happiness and make us sad. But we can never let them get the best of us, because that would be a defeat. I don't know, Jerry. I don't like it. Hey Morty, check this out. I found this painting on the internet and it looks pretty neat. It does. It's like a painting of a Star Wars character. What do you think? Yeah, it's really cool. Is it your favorite scene from the movie? Yeah, it's one of my favorite scenes. Why is it your favorite scene? Because it's just so cool. Yeah, it's just so cool. The green lightsaber and the blue background are just so cool. Yeah, the lightsaber's really bright and the background's really blue. It's just so colorful and cool. Who's that? I have no idea, it's a weird poster. Yeah, it's really psychedelic. What do you think it's about? Sci-fi, I think.
look at that. It's a beautiful picture of a beautiful woman. Who is she? Less than name greater than, less than text greater than. Look at that. It's a beautiful picture of a beautiful woman. Hmm. Okay. Well, I'm going to keep looking at it, then. Fine. Thanks, Morty. So Morty, I think we're onto something big here. Yeah, I think so too Rick. This image is definitely meant to be some kind of message or symbol. What do you think Rick, is Kate Winslet an alien? I don't know Jerry, but I really want to find out. I'm with Rick on this one Jerry. I want to know what she's up to. I hear you Morty. I bet she's doing amazing things in space. True Morty, true. Now let's get back to our painting and figure out what aliens might be behind it. This is a great picture. Yeah, I like the balls in her hair. I think Kylian Mbappe would look great in it. Kylian Mbappe? What's he do? He's a soccer player. Yeah, we'll just have to find out. Okay, sounds good to me. If I had to pick one character in sci-fi that I identify with, it would have to be Biryani. I'm always up for a good adventure and I love to try new things. Plus, the guy is always looking fly. Agreed, Biryani is one of my favorite characters. He always stands up for what he believes in and he's always up for a good time. He's a total hoot. Aw, oh, Morty, it's definitely worth it. It's a masterpiece. Hey Morty, what's cooking? Biryani, Jerry, thanks for asking. How's Indian food taste? It's good, I think. Looks like Morty's dad approves. Yeah, I don't know about art, but I can taste the biryani. Ooh, cool. Looks like we're gonna explore the galaxy soon. Yup, space is the sky's the limit. Yeah, I think so too. I mean, it's a really heroic image. Well, I don't know about that. I mean, I don't really see what the big deal is about the bird. Uh, you wouldn't think so, but to me it's a really powerful image. Yeah, I think you're right. It's a great picture. Yeah, it really is. Yeah. I guess you could say that. Man. That's one wild picture. Yeah, it's pretty dope. In a simple man's voice, isn't it? I don't understand how they make pictures like that, though. In a rich Rick voice. Oh, Morty, 
you're such a doofus. You don't even know what art is. It's all about expressing yourself through beautiful pictures. Yeah, I'm really glad you like it. Glad we could share a favorite artist together. Yeah, totally. Always good to have a shared passion in life. Interesting picture. What do you think it means? It's a great example of sci-fi art. Silly kids, just looking at pretty pictures isn't going to get us anywhere. Hey Rick, what's that on the robot side? That's R2-D2 from Star Wars Morty. He's a really cool robot. Oh, I love Star Wars. I've always been a big fan. Me too, Jerry. Me too. This is a great picture, Morty. It's a woman with red hair and blue eyes posing for a picture with a black background and a silver background. Morty. It's an excellent photo, Rick. She's beautiful. Yeah, I think so too, Morty. She's definitely a standout in any crowd. Morty. Hey, Jerry. What do you think of the picture? Jerry. Oh, it's a nice picture, Morty. I like the blue eyes in it. Yeah, it's a lot better than the one in my room. You have a better room? Yeah, it's got a bigger poster and... Oh, I see. Well, your taste must be pretty good. Thanks, Dad. Hey, Morty. What's up? Not much, just studying for my science test. Oh, okay. I see you got a new poster. Yeah, it's Stargate SG-1. MMHMM, I've seen that show. It's pretty good. Yeah, I've been watching it too. It's really good. I'm glad you like it, Dad. Holy crap, this is a great picture. Yeah, I love it. It's so nostalgic. Yeah, me too, man. I remember taking that picture. It was right before we left for our space mission. Hey, I'm Morty's dad and I have no clue about art. Jerry, this is an amazing picture. Yeah, I think so too. Yo Morty, check out this cool picture I found. It's a painting of a woman with white hair and green eyes wearing a scarf and a green dress with white feathers and a green background. This is the perfect poster for us. Yeah, I totally agree. Me too. Let's go get one. Rick and Morty go to Jerry's house to ask for help making a poster like the one in the title text. But Jerry has no idea how to make it so they have to make it themselves. Morty. Help me hold the canvas up while I paint. Sure. Hey, I'm not so sure about this. Rick and Morty make the poster themselves using Jerry's house as a backdrop. Looks great, Morty. Thanks for helping us out. No problem.
Is that a king? I don't know, that's a pretty weird looking crown. Yeah, I don't know what it is, but I want to know more about it. Hey Morty, what do you think about this picture? It's cool. I love the background with the bird. Yeah, I'm glad you like it. It's one of my favorite paintings. What kind of painting is it? Um, I'd like to go on an adventure with a group of cats. Do you think that's possible? Yeah, I think so. So, what kind of cat would you like to adventure with? I'm not sure. I'm open to anything. Oh, I love it when you're open to new ideas. So, what about a black cat? Interesting. I'll have to think about it. Thanks for the suggestion, Morty. No problem, Rick. Dude, check out that head. It's like a totally different world inside her. Yeah, it's like she's got a whole other life going on up in there. Dude, I could just spend hours looking at that thing. Isn't Bender Futurama one of Rick's favorite shows? Yeah, I think so too. But I don't understand why he doesn't like art. He's not a smart guy. He doesn't understand art. That's true, I guess but I still think he's a cool robot. He's just a simple man, with no clue about art. Yeah, I guess you're right. This looks like a good painting, Morty. Yeah, I think so too, Rick. I love how the quote is in the painting too. Yeah, genius, 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 genius. Holy crap. What's up, Rick? Check this out, Morty. Why is it so great? It's a picture of us. Really? Yeah, check it out. The three of us standing next to each other. He's right, Jerry. We're a team and nothing can stand in our way. All right, Morty. It's time to get ready for our next adventure. What do you have in mind, Rick? I'm thinking we should go explore another planet. That sounds like a lot of fun. Yeah, I'm not so sure about that, Rick. I don't think I would be that into traveling to different worlds. I'm too simple a man with no clue about art to appreciate that. That's true Jerry, but I still think it's worth it. After all, we're in complete control of our destiny. We can do whatever we want Morty. That's the spirit Rick! Neat image Morty, looks like you could use a little more color in your life. Yeah, you're right. Isn't that the truth Morty? And it's not like I don't know what I'm talking about. I once beat up a brutal space tyrant with only my bare hands. She's called Minbari. Cool name. What's going on? We're analyzing the picture, Jerry. What does it mean? We're not sure, 
but it looks like she could be from a sci-fi adventure. What kind of adventure? Woman in a blue dress from Babylon 5, standing in front of a yellow background with a Star Trek character on it. Minbari, Babylon 5. Oh, I've seen that show. It's cool. Yeah, it's great. Yeah, that looks like an interesting picture. Is it some sort of sci-fi thing? Yeah, it looks like it's from one of our adventures. I don't know, Morty. I think it would be kind of boring to just look up at the sky all the time. Look at the detail in the picture. It's amazing. Yeah, it's really cool how they managed to show that level of detail in the cartoon. What do you think, Jerry? I love it, Morty. It's great. This is an amazing picture. Yeah, I love Underdog. I know, me too. He's my favorite superhero. Why is he your favorite? Because he always overcomes the odds. Its eyes are really weird looking. Its hair is kind of red. Yeah, I think its hair is red. Its body is kind of weird too. What do you think? It's not bad, is it Morty? No, it's great Rick. I love Radiohead. I don't get it Morty, the eyes look gross. You're just not used to art Jerry. It's a cool picture. Yeah, it's really good. It's called In Rainbows. I'll have to check that out. Hey Morty, check out this piece of art. It's really amazing. Yeah, definitely. It's beautiful. You think so? I think it's a really great depiction of a woman. Yeah, sounds good Rick. Hey Morty, wanna come watch TV with me? Oh Jerry, I'm so busy with Rick. We're going to hang out later. Okay, I see. Well have fun then. Rick and Morty are having a great time looking at pictures. They talk about their sci-fi adventures and how much fun they have. Jerry just sits on a couch watching TV.
That's a pretty cool picture Morty. I like the way that it's juxtaposed with the firecracker in her hand. It gives it a lot of dynamics. Yeah, I think it's really cool. I wonder what it would look like if you added a spaceship or something in the background. Hey Morty, do you want to see my new painting? It's just a bunch of squiggles. Sounds boring. I'm going to go watch TV. This is a great picture, Morty. It captures the feeling of adventure and freedom. Yeah, the eagle on the back is really cool. It looks like it's flying. Hmm, Sao Paulo, huh? Interesting city. Yeah, I bet it's a blast to visit. Yeah, it's amazing. Well, I guess that's all we can really learn from this picture. Yeah, I think so too. This is perfect for our bedroom. It's mysterious and elegant. It's perfect, Dad. What are you guys talking about? We're talking about our new sci-fi poster. Morty, she's one of the most intelligent people in the world. There's no way you can't agree with that. All right, I'll give you that. But I still don't think she's the most beautiful person in the world. Morty, come on. She's absolutely amazing. You have to respect her intelligence. All right, I'll give you that, but I still think she's not the most beautiful person in the world. Jerry is sitting alone in a dark room thinking about his life when an alien spaceship appears in the sky and beams him up. He soon discovers that he is on a starship with Rick, Morty, and a talking dog. They are going on a sci-fi adventure to explore different planets and galaxies. While on their journey they encounter strange and dangerous creatures. Jerry is surprised by how excited he is for the adventure and he learns a lot about himself. The end. What is it Rick? It's from the Smiths. It's a reference to their song. The boy with the thorn in his side. Dude, you're like a genius. You know Rick, I never really understood art. I was just happy spending time with you too. Rick is happy and wholesome. Morty is happy and wholesome. Everyone has a positive vibe. Jerry is Morty's dad and he's a simple man with no clue about art. They're from the show Rick and Morty, you have to use their personality and the way they talk in the show. I think it's amazing too Rick. This is so cool. You know Morty, I think that painting is really cool. Yeah Jerry, I think so too. It's really unique and I love the way the colors look. Yeah, the colors are really beautiful Morty. I agree Rick. I think it's beautiful.
This is a sci-fi painting of a man with a beard and mustache on Mars. It's amazing. I love it. What does it mean? I mean, look at the detail in the background. It's like we're right there on Mars. Yeah, I know. It's insane. I'm so happy we got this, Morty. I feel like we're one step closer to our sci-fi dreams coming true. Yeah, I know. I'm just so happy we got this. This is a really cool picture Morty. It's an illustration of Captain Kirk from the show, Star Trek. Yeah, I like it Rick. It's a really cool image. This is a great painting, Morty. It's really atmospheric. Yeah, I totally love it. I just wonder what it would look like in reality. Aha, uh -huh. that's a good question. Maybe one day we'll find out. Hey, Morty. Why don't you show me this cool picture you were looking at? Sure, Jerry. Here you go. Oh, Morty. This is beautiful. Jerry, you don't understand art. Huh? You don't know anything about art, Jerry. You're a simple man without any clue. Oh, sorry, Morty. I didn't know that. I guess I just don't see things the same way as you do. Well, that's okay, Morty. You can learn about art from me. I've been studying it for years. Cool. I'm looking forward to it. Rick and Morty are getting along great and Jerry is getting along great too. Dude, check out that guy. He looks like a badass. I can't wait to go on another science fiction adventure with Morty. Yeah, him too. I hope this one's more exciting than the last one we went on. Remember when we found a giant alien creature? It was kinda lame. Yeah, I think so too. It's got a lot of color and it looks really cool. Yeah, I'm really happy with it. So am I. Hey Morty. You want to come and play some video games with me and Rick? Sure. I always enjoy playing video games with Jerry. Holy crap Morty, that picture is fantastic. Yeah, I think it's really cool how they incorporated the sci-fi elements into the painting. Yeah, I totally think so too. We should totally paint like that someday. I can't believe it's from a show called, Rick and Morty. That's so cool. I know, I love that show. Hey guys, you want to see my new piece? Rick and Morty immediately stop what they are doing. Look at Jerry and give him a confused look. What? It's just an oil painting. Rick and laughing. What's so funny? Rick and oh, nothing. We're just really impressed by your new painting.
Holy crap Morty this is incredible. You should come see our sci-fi movie sometime. Yeah I'd love to Rick, I've always been a big fan. Oh hey guys. What's going on? You mean like your European vacation? Normal voice. Oh, yeah, I guess you could say that. Normal voice, oh, okay. Rick and Morty continue discussing their sci-fi adventures while Jerry just listens and has no idea what they're talking about. Man, Morty, those wings are just so cool. Yeah, I know. I love how the colors pop and everything. You're right, they look amazing. Well, what do you think, Jerry? No, no, not you, Zap. I just think he's cool. Ah, oh, whatever. And he's got this totally dopey hat on, too. What, again? No, no, not you, the hat. I just think it's funny. It's just a stupid hat. You know what I mean. Fine, you're right. And he's got this really cool glowing ball. What, again? No, no, not the ball. I mean the character. Oh, yeah, he's pretty cool. Yeah, I think he's the coolest cartoon character ever. I guess you're right. Holy crap, that's Robert Downey Jr. Yeah, I know. He's super famous. I always wanted to meet him. Yeah, me too. He's really cool. Dude, your son is into weird stuff. Oh man, it looks like our next stop is Oslo. No way! Oslo is so cool! I'm so excited to see it! I don't know. It doesn't look that great to me. Oh, come on Jerry, it's one of the most famous sci-fi cities in the entire galaxy. It's got to be pretty cool. Beats me, but it's always fun to just go on wild goose chases and come up with new ideas. That's the spirit. This is a cool picture. I love the feel of the city in the background. Yeah, it looks really realistic. That's a really cool poster. I'm not sure how I would paint something like that, but it's definitely cool. Hey Rick, what's up? Oh Jerry, just getting some pictures for Morty. This looks like a great picture. Oh sure, I see it. I'm just happy that Morty is finally getting a little bit of excitement in his life. Yeah. I know just the spot for our next sci-fi adventure Morty.
Man, that's some sick shit Ray. You really knocked it out of the park with that painting. Yeah, I really like the way the colors look together. Yeah, I totally agree Morty. This painting is totally dope. Yeah, me too Rick. Hey kids, what's going on? We're just analyzing this picture Morty, it's great. Oh, okay. I see. Well have fun. I'm going to go do some painting. All right, Jerry, have fun. Yeah, have fun, Jerry. Rick and Morty are discussing a picture of Ray from Star Wars. Jerry walks by and they stop talking. Oh Morty, check this out. It's a picture of a Batman character in a suit with a sword in his hand and a helmet on his head, with a light shining behind him. Ed Norton, The Honeymooners. Dang, that's dope. Yeah, I think so too. What do you think Jerry? Yeah, I want to go see some of the booths. What are some of your favorite sci-fi movies? My favorite sci-fi movie of all time is The Day the Earth Stood Still. It's my favorite movie too. Do you have any suggestions for me on what to buy at the art booth? Yeah, I'd buy a science fiction painting. Why don't you buy a science fiction poster? Okay, I'll consider that. Thanks, Rick. Rick and Morty are sitting in the kitchen eating their pizza. Rick is happy and wholesome. Morty is happy and wholesome. Everyone has a positive vibe. Jerry is Morty's dad and he's a simple man with no clue about art. They're from the show Rick and Morty, you have to use their personality and the way they talk in the show. Here's the conversation. Hey Morty, how's school going? It's good, I'm taking a painting class. That's great, Morty, what are you painting? I'm working on a portrait of my teacher. That's amazing, Morty, did you try any new techniques? I did, I used a lot of blue and green stock to create a sky color. That's really good, Morty. I'm sure your teacher will be pleased with it. I'm sure he will. Dude, that's amazing. What's the story behind it? I have no idea, it just looks cool. Is that a painting of Messi? Yeah, I've seen it before. It's a great painting. Our sci-fi adventures. Yeah, I can't believe we're actually doing this. We're going to explore the galaxy and meet new aliens and battles new and exciting space monsters. Yeah, I can't wait. Hey guys, what's going on? Hey Jerry. We're just discussing our sci-fi adventures. Oh yeah, I remember those. They were pretty cool. Wow Morty, looks like we're going to have to go to San Francisco to get justice. Yep Rick, I know it's a tough mission, but we can do it. Hey guys, who wants to see my new art piece? Jerry, we're really busy Morty, we'll talk to you later. Yeah, she's pretty cool. This isn't art, Morty. What do you mean, Jerry? I mean, this is a picture, it doesn't have any artistic value. That's not true, Jerry. He's right Morty, this isn't art. Oh man, I was sure Jerry would like it. He's got a point, Morty. This is just a picture, there's no creativity here. You're right Jerry, there's no creativity here.
This is amazing Morty. It's just like one of those paintings I've always wanted to create. Yeah, it's really cool Rick. I love the way the colors overlap and the way the man's eyes look so sad. Morty, your dad's not exactly into art. He's pretty simple, you know. Yeah, I know. But there's nothing wrong with simplicity, is there? I wouldn't say that. Simplicity can be just as beautiful as anything else. Well, I guess you're right. Yay, Team Positive Vibes! This is amazing Morty. It looks like you captured the essence of Worf perfectly. Yeah, I had a lot of fun painting it. It's been a while since I've had any fun painting. Yeah, I can tell. It's a great reminder of the good times we've had. Yeah, we'll definitely be doing some great sci-fi adventures together. Yeah, just like in our show Rick and Morty. Jerry. Heh <laughs> heh, I'm sure you two will have a lot of fun exploring the universe. Yeah, we'll definitely be doing some great sci-fi adventures together. Morty. Yeah, just like in our show Rick and Morty. Jerry. Heh <laughs> heh, I'm sure you two will have a lot of fun exploring the universe. Nice picture, Morty. Yeah, check out the swirls. What do you think, Rick? I love it. It's stylish and creative. Yeah, I totally agree, Jerry. Art is definitely one of the most important things in life. I couldn't agree more, Rick. How does this remind you of one of our adventures? Yeah, I remember we went to this planet and there was a frog sitting on top of a cushion in front of a mirror with a picture of a frog on it. Yeah, paella is one of my favorite dishes. It's a Spanish dish made with seafood, vegetables, and rice. Yeah, I know about it. I've had some before. I love Spanish food. It's such a unique flavor. Yeah, I know about it. I've had some before. Wow, that's some pretty advanced sci-fi art. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I bet if we used some of these techniques in our comics, we could really amp up the level of sophistication. Dad, I'm telling you, those eyes are special. What do you mean? They're like a portal to the other side. Hmm, well I guess it's not a bad thing. I'm telling you, they're magical. Ordy, stop it, those eyes are just regular eyes. Who cares, they're cool. Dad! What? Stop being so negative. It doesn't make them any less cool. Ordy, stop being so enthusiastic about this. But Rick, they are magical. Ordy, you're being way too hyped up about this. What do you mean? I mean, the eyes might be cool, but that's all they are. Just ordinary eyes.
This looks like a Michael Crab Cake picture. What can we learn from it? It's a great picture. What a badass Michael Crab Cake looks like. Huh? What are you guys talking about? I was just thinking, Morty, that I really wish we could go to space. Yeah, I've always wanted to see what's out there. Huh? What are you guys talking about? That's a cool picture, Morty. What do you think it is? I have no idea, Rick. It's just strange. Yeah, I love it too. Yo Morty, check out this sci-fi picture I found. It's got a tall tower with a clock on top of it near a city skyline with boats in the water and a boat in the water. Yeah, it's great. It's like a painting of a woman with some seafood on her head. You're right Morty, it's like a painting of a woman with a crab and lobster on her head and legs. Really Rick? Did you ever think of that? Yeah I did. I thought it was a really poignant way to depict a woman's relationship with seafood. You're right Rick, I hadn't thought of it that way at all. Dude, she's got some big boobs. They're huge. What kind of bird is that? A phoenix. Damn, Morty, that's one hell of a phoenix necklace. Aw, oh, thank you Rick, you're the best too. Man, that Bugs Bunny is dope. Yup, I think he's really cool. I don't really get art, but I think that cartoon character is pretty cool. Sure Jerry, what movie do you want to watch? I don't know, what do you want to watch? Let's watch a movie about a rabbit with a pink nose and ears. Oh, that sounds fun Rick! Alright, I'll get the popcorn. Zeppelin, one of my favorite bands. Rad, what are some of your favorite songs? Um, let me think. Stairway to Heaven, Since I've Been Loving You, Kashmir. Is that a picture of you, Morty? What? No, it's not. Oh well, I'm just wondering. Jerry, you don't have to worry about it. Morty's dad's never been into pictures much so I don't think he'd know what it is. Oh, okay. To Morty. What you been up to? Just hanging out with my friends and playing video games. Yeah, that sounds like fun. How's school going? It's okay. I'm doing fine, I guess. That's great, man. I'm glad you're doing well. Wow. It's like Rick and Morty are just living normal lives and I'm not even in the picture. 
Yeah, I guess that's how it is when you're not in the spotlight. I guess you're right. That's a beautiful picture, Morty. Yeah, it's awesome. I like how the colors look in the background. Yeah, I think it looks like a really cool scene from a sci-fi movie. Man, this is some high quality art here. Yeah, I really like it. Wow, this is really amazing. I'm really happy with how it turned out, Morty. Yeah, me too. Holy crap. It's the Whitehead Institute for Biomedical Research. That's the place where they're doing all that weird science. Yeah, I actually went there once. It was really cool. Hey Morty, is your dad home? I need to ask him about this Will Smith painting. He's a pretty simple man and he doesn't seem to know much about art. No Jerry, my dad isn't home. He's out fishing with my grandpa. Oh, well that's fine then. I'll ask him about the painting some other time. Thanks for the info, Morty. Thank you, Jerry. We'll have a blast analyzing this painting together. Holy crap, that's one big sandwich. Yeah, it's huge. Is that a sandwich or buffet? This is a really neat painting. It's like a painting of a man with green eyes and a beard with a strange face and a red and white hair. What's up, Pico de Gallo? It's a great picture, Morty. I love the way the light is shining on the man's face. I know, it's amazing how he managed to capture the light so perfectly. Yeah. Well, I'm glad you think so, Morty. I was really proud of it. I think it's a great picture, Morty. Hey, Jerry, I think Morty and I are going to go watch some sci-fi movies tonight. Want to come with us? I don't know, Rick. I'm kind of tired. Don't worry, Jerry. We'll take it easy. Just sit here and relax. Okay, Rick. I'll see you later. See you, Morty. Hey, Jerry. Let's go watch some movies with Rick and Rick. Okay, Morty. I'll see you later. This is a really cool painting, Morty. Yeah, I really like it too. So, what do you think about it? I like it a lot. It's awesome to see two guys from different parts of the universe together in one picture. Jerry, you're not helping. Sorry, Rick. It's just not very good. Don't worry, Jerry. I'm sure Morty will like it. Yeah, Rick. I really like it. I can't believe they made it look so realistic.
Uh, I didn't know they made aliens like that. Yeah, they're pretty common. Wow, so we've been journeying to different parts of the galaxy, right? Actually, no, we've just been going around in circles. It reminds me of some of the sci-fi adventures we've been on. Yeah, it does look like something from one of the adventures. I'm really happy with it, Morty. Me too, Rick. It's a great painting. That's a really good picture of Betty Boop. Yeah, she looks super happy. You're right, Morty. She seems really content. Yeah, I think she's really beautiful. Yeah, Betty Boop is one of my favorite cartoons. This is the first time we've ever gotten an image of a bug-eyed monster. It's an amazing find Morty. I can't wait to share it with Jerry and the others back at the lab. Yeah Rick, I'm super excited too. I bet they're going to be so excited to see it. They always seem to be so into science stuff. That's Rick with a beard and green eyes. He's one of the best characters on the show. Who's the other guy? That's Morty with a beard and green eyes. He's also one of the best characters on the show. Hey Morty, what's that? That's a picture of Rick and me. Whoa, that's really cool. But, how come your father is in the picture? My dad is in the picture because he's the one who took the picture. I see. That's pretty cool. Hello. My name is Rick and I'm a simple man from the show Rick and Morty. I like adventures and science and I'm really happy with my life. Morty is also a happy and wholesome person and we have a positive vibe in our relationship. Jerry is Morty's dad and he's a simple man without any clue about art, but he loves us and supports us. I hope you enjoy our conversation. Yeah, it's cool. What other adventures have you gone on Rick? Lots of different ones Morty. We've explored the galaxy many times. Really? How'd you do that? We used our spaceship, of course. HHMMIC, so you're a space explorer like me. Exactly, Morty, and I know you're going to be an epic space captain one day. Yeah, I hope so, Rick. I'm really inspired by your adventures. another fantastic painting, Morty. Yeah, it's really good, Rick. I'm so proud of you, Morty. 4. I can only imagine what adventures he's had. 5. It's unbelievable how big the Star Trek universe is. 6. I always feel so inspired by its stories. 7. It's always amazing to me how detailed their universe is. 8. It's a real honor to be a part of it. 9. It's a dream come true for any fan. 10. Absolutely.
This is a great picture. We should use it for our next sci-fi adventure. Yeah, it's really great. I love how surreal it is. I don't know about you dudes, but I'm just not that interested in art. You guys are so sweet. Yeah, we're just happy living our simple life and exploring the universe. Yeah, I love that you guys are so happy. It's such a refreshing change. Dude, check out that suit. It's so friggin' cool. Yeah, I totally agree. Looks like they could totally be in a futuristic movie. Huh? What are you blabbering about now, Rick? This picture is amazing Morty. It looks like we're exploring the universe again. Yeah, I love exploring new worlds Rick. It's always so fun to see what's out there. Hey Morty, do you want to see my new painting? He's a simple man, so he might not understand the finer details of art, but he's the best dad ever. Yeah, he's the best dad ever. Hey guys, what's going on? Hey Jerry, here's one of our latest sci-fi pictures. Wow. That's amazing. What does it depict? According to what Morty and I can see, it looks like it's from one of our most recent adventures. I see. That sounds like a lot of fun. Yeah, it's been great spending time with Morty. He's such a fun and wholesome kid. He's a lot like me, in a way. He's not too complicated, and he loves spending time with family and friends. That's the best kind of kid. This is a great picture. What exactly is it saying? I don't know, but it looks like a sandwich. What kind of sandwich, Morty? Bart Simpson. Yeah, I know, right? Rick and what kind of dog is that? Bart Simpson, a bulldog. Rick and cool. I've never seen anything like this before. This is so sci-fi. Bart Simpson. Yeah, I know, right? Rick and this is so cool. Peace. That's a crazy art piece. Yeah, it's really cool. Just like in our sci-fi adventures, Rick. Exactly, Jerry. I love the way our adventures just take us to new and exciting places. But that's not what counts, Jerry. What counts is how much you like their work. I guess you're right. Always am, Rick. Now, can we please talk about our sci-fi adventures? Yeah, I'm dying to hear about them. All right, Morty. All start. We were investigating a strange energy source on a distant planet. Really? What did you find? We didn't find anything, Morty. We were captured by a race of aliens and turned into sex slaves. Ew! That's terrible! Wait, so you guys never actually found the energy source? No, Jerry. We were captured and tortured for months. Total nightmare. That's terrible! What happened to you guys afterwards? We escaped Jerry, 
and we're now living a wholesome life on Earth. Wow, that's great, Rick. I'm so glad you're both okay. Yeah, me too, Morty. Me too. Man, it's crazy how different this painting makes me feel. Yeah, it's really inspiring, Rick. I love how the bird reminds us that our time is limited but we can still reach our goals. I think we could make a great sci-fi episode out of this. I bet we could make a scene where the woman with the tattoos and top is fighting some evil aliens. Yeah, that sounds like a great idea. Hey Morty, what's going on? Hey Dad. We're just talking about our sci-fi adventures. Oh, okay. I see. Well, I'm glad you're both happy. Hey Morty, check out this sci-fi painting I found. It's called, The Man with the Long Hair and the Bearded Dude with the Mustache. I agree. These crab cakes look fantastic. Aw, these crab cakes look so good. I'm so happy for you too. Thanks Jerry, we really appreciate your support. No problem Rick, anytime. This looks really good Morty. I can't wait to show it to Captain Picard. Hey Rick, I think I made something really cool. Check it out. Holy crap Morty, that's incredible. I can't believe you made that. Yeah, Morty, your dad is a simple man and he doesn't understand art at all. But he's the best dad in the world. Thanks, Jerry. You're the bestest dad in the whole world, too. That's a great picture. I love the space background. Yeah, it's really cool. What are you guys talking about? We were just talking about our sci-fi adventures. Oh, yeah. I was just telling Rick about this one time we went to this planet where the people were all giant insects and the only thing we could eat was this tandoori chicken. Well, I'm sure you two will enjoy cooking it up. Yeah, I can't wait to try out that recipe. The chicken looks really good. Yeah, it does. Well, I'll leave you to it then. Rick and Morty are talking about their favorite sci-fi adventure. They are excited about the chicken adventure they will have. Jerry is Morty's dad and he has no clue about art. The way they talk in the show is used in this episode. Hmm, this is a really good poster. I wonder what the story is behind it. I don't know, Rick, it looks like a cool picture. What do you think it could symbolize? I don't know, man, 
but I'm getting the feeling that it has something to do with a sci-fi adventure. 4. This could be an interspecies message of some kind. 5. Well, I guess that just means we need to figure out which dog is which. 6. This is so confusing, but I guess it's worth taking a look. 7. Hey, maybe we can solve the mystery by combining the pictures. 8. Perfect. Let's try it out. 9. Awesome, it worked. 10. Okay, so now what? This seems like a pretty big deal. Oh Morty, check this out, it's a poster of Edinburgh. Holy crap Rick, that's awesome! I always wanted to go to Edinburgh. Hmm, I wonder why it's called Edinburgh. I didn't catch that. It's probably because it's from Edinburgh, Scotland, Rick. Oh, Edinburgh, Scotland. I didn't know that, that's amazing, Morty. Hey Morty, what's up? Just talking to Rick and Jerry about our sci-fi adventures. Oh. I see. That sounds fun. Wow, Morty, that's really cool. This is how a futuristic woman should look. Yeah, Rick, I love it. She's so fierce and determined. You think so, Morty? Definitely, Rick. Aunt Viv is stunning. Dude, that's Batman. Whoa, right. I think we should cosplay as him and you for our next convention. Yeah, I don't know. Jerry's not really into that kind of thing. Totally. This looks like a really cool image. I can't wait to explore more of the universe. Yeah, I'm totally into sci-fi adventures too. I can't wait to explore new worlds and meet new people. I just think that Rick and Morty are really cool people and I want them to be happy and healthy. Morty, you're the artist. Okay, I think the beard is a little too simple. What do you mean? I think if we added more detail to the beard, it would make the piece look more dynamic. Like what? Like maybe a detail cutting through the beard or a light shining through the hole in the beard. Yeah, I think you're right. You know, I actually have an idea. But is it Jerry? Why don't you mod the beard to look like it's made out of metal? Morty, I think Jerry has a good idea. I like it. Dude, that's a masterpiece. Yeah, it is. I didn't know you were into art. I'm not really into it, per se. 
It's more just something I like looking at. The painting is just perfect. Yeah, it's awesome. Well, first of all, these crabs look unsettling. They're almost making a face. They're definitely scraggly looking. I agree, Morty. They don't look like they're at peace. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, I know, Jerry. It's a mystery. But that's part of the fun of art, isn't it, Morty? Trying to figure out what the paintings are saying. Yeah, I guess so. This is awesome. Yeah, it's really good. What do you think, Jerry? It's not bad. I think it's a good image. Yeah, it is. I really like it. Yeah, me too. This is a really nice painting. Yeah, I really like it. How come it's not selling? Beats us. It's nice, though. Rick and Morty ignore Jerry, continuing to analyze the picture. You know, I'm not really sure. I'm a little bit out of my element when it comes to sci-fi art. Yeah, I'm not really sure either, Rick. But I think it's really cool. Yeah, I think you're right, Morty. It's cool. God damn, Morty, that's one fine looking leopard. You think so? I was thinking the same thing. Yeah, I mean, they're always such interesting creatures. They're amazing, Jerry. I love how you can customize your burrito. I love that you can customize your burrito, Rick. I don't know about that, Morty. Rick and Morty continue to discuss their love for burritos and their favorite toppings. Rick is happy and wholesome. Morty is happy and wholesome. And Jerry is just a simple man who has no clue about art. They are from the show Rick and Morty, and you have to use their personality and the way they talk in the show to create this sci-fi episode. Dang, those stripes on his shirt look trippy. Yeah, they look really psychedelic. Did you know that the stripes on a man's shirt are actually one of the more iconic features of fashion? I have no idea. What a weird painting. Wow, what a strange painting. Yeah, it's really off-putting. I can't believe this is a Rick and Morty painting. Yeah, it's pretty nuts. Yeah, it's a little weird. I wonder who painted it. Well, I don't know, but I hope they're happy with it. Yeah, I guess so. That's a really weird painting.
Man, that's one messed up head. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with that. I think we should investigate that. Yeah, that would be so cool. Huh. I don't know about that. I think it would be more interesting to make a sci-fi adventure about the monkeys. Yeah, I guess you're right. You know, Morty's dad doesn't even know about art. Yeah, I know. He's a pretty simple guy. So, is it just me or does Morty's dad look a lot like you? Rick and Morty both laugh. Rick says, I have no idea what you're talking about, and they continue to talk about their sci-fi adventures. Rick and Morty are analyzing in details a picture with this description while also talking about their sci-fi adventures. A man with glasses and a yellow jacket in front of a painting of a man with a blue beard, Zurich. This is a great picture Morty. The colors are beautiful. This could be the background of one of our scenes. Morty. Yeah. I love the way the blue contrasts with the yellow and the brown in the background. Yeah same. This picture could be the perfect background for our next scene. Morty. What do you think? Morty. Yeah, I think so too Rick. This would make a great background for our next scene. Less than name greater than. This is a great picture Morty. The colors are beautiful. This could be the background of one of our scenes. Yeah, I think it's a great picture. It's a really cool setting. Hey Rick, what's that city in the middle of the picture? That's Zurich. It's a really big city and it's surrounded by a lot of other big cities. It's a really cool place. That's interesting. I've never been there. You should check it out. It's a really neat place. Yeah, I think you would like it, Jerry. I might. I'll have to get to Zurich one day. Yeah, it's a really neat place. This is an amazing painting. It's great, Dad. What do you think it is? I have no idea, Morty. I'm just a little guy who likes to eat shrimp. I bet you're a great artist, Dad. Dude, you have to check out this picture. It's amazing. Yeah, I really like it. It's a cartoon character with a yellow and blue background and a blue and yellow background with a yellow and blue background, Rugrats. It's a cartoon character from a show called Rick and Morty. What the hell is that doing in our house? I don't know, Rick. It just showed up one day. Is it a good show, Morty? Yeah, it's really good. Well, I'm glad you like it. I always watch it when I'm bored. This catastrophe has to stop. We're not watching that show again. But Rick, it's so good. No, Morty, we are not watching that show again. But Rick, it's so good. No, Morty, we are not watching that show again. Good old Jerry, he always knows just what to say. 
You know, Dad, sometimes I feel like he doesn't really understand art. Nonsense, Morty. I love all forms of art. Just look at that painting over there. I know the feeling, Rick. I used to love watching those two cartoons together. Lately, though, I've been really attached to a new show called Rick and Morty. Really? What's it about? It's an adult swim show about a scientist and his grandson who travel through space and time. That sounds awesome, Rick. Yeah, it is. I love how they depict the sci-fi elements in the show. For example, in one episode they go to the future and meet a version of Rick who's a mad scientist. Yep, that was a great episode. And then there was the episode where they go back in time and meet dinosaurs. Yeah, that was amazing. Anyway, I think the show is really cool and I can't wait to watch more. Me too, Morty. Me too. This is a really cool picture. Yeah, I love it. It's so creative. I know. It's amazing how he was able to get all the colors exactly right. Yeah, totally. And the rhinos are so neat. Yeah, I think it would. That's a beautiful picture, Morty. It reminds me of when we saved the world from the evil aliens. Yeah, it was great. We were so brave. I think we should make a sci-fi adventure about it. Definitely. What kind of sci-fi adventure would we make? I don't know, something where we save the world or something. I totally agree. Hey, you two stop talking and pay attention to me. I'm trying to watch TV here. Damn it, Morty. You forgot to weld those connectors on the power conduit. Dad, I'm sorry. I'll try to be more careful next time. Morty, why don't you go put your dishes in the dishwasher? You're right, Jerry. It doesn't need any more detail. This is a great painting, Morty. It's like a painting from one of our sci-fi adventures. Yeah, Rick, it totally looks like one of the paintings from one of our sci-fi adventures. Yeah, Morty, it totally looks like one of the paintings from one of our sci-fi adventures. Hey, Rick, go take a look at this piece of art Morty made. Jerry, is that Morty's artwork? Yep, it's an amazing job. Wow, Morty did an amazing job with this. He's so creative and talented. Thanks, Rick. I really appreciate it. Rick and Morty are always happy and positive and they have a great relationship. They always help each other out and have great conversations.
This is a pretty bad picture. Wow, it's a scientist. Yeah, I lo love sci-fi. They, they keep analyzing the picture with Rick pointing out all the details while Morty asks questions and they have a discussion. Meanwhile, Jerry is watching them and he says to Man Man with no clue about art. He just, he just thinks, thinks that his son is playing with some toy. Oh man, this is great. Yeah, this is awesome. Who's that? That's a character from our sci-fi adventure. He's a cartoon character with a pen in his hand and a pencil in his other hand. With a blue background, CERN, European Organization for Nuclear Research. Man, I wish we could go see it up close. Yeah, I know. But we can't, it's just a poster. Yeah, I know. This is an amazing painting, Morty. I love it. Yeah, it's pretty good. I think the fire in the background adds some realism to it. Exactly, Morty. The fire really amps up the realism. I bet if we could find a triangle made of oysters like this, it would be the perfect portal to our next adventure. Hmm. I don't get it. What's the deal with the hoods? Hey, I don't know. Maybe they're trying to preserve their anonymity or something. Maybe it's because they're evil and want to keep their identity hidden? You know, I think that's a great theory. You're right, Morty. It makes total sense. This is an interesting picture. It's got a star in the background and a planet in the foreground. I like it. I think it's a really cool picture. Hey Rick, what's going on? Three, that could be the case Morty. Do you think the green background could be an indication of something sinister? Yeah, I think there might be something weird going on with the background. Four, you're right Rick. It does look kind of like a crime scene. So what do you think the story could be behind it? Well, I'm not sure, but I think it might be a story about a scary man with horns and a beard. Maybe he's a criminal or something. Who knows? But I think it's really cool that we can interpret things like paintings and stories in different ways because it gives us so much liberty to interpret the world around us. This is a great picture, Rick. What do you think it represents? I think it's a representation of a person with advanced technology. You're right, Morty. It's a great picture and it represents someone who is very tech savvy. Ah, uh, Morty, I don't think this is a real picture. What do you mean, Jerry? I mean, I don't think it's actually real. It just looks like a picture. Oh. What do you think, Morty? Do you think Jerry's right? I guess so. It does look like a picture.
This is beautiful Morty. The colors are so vibrant. Yeah, I think it's really cool how they captured Barcelona's skyline in the background. I'm so happy and wholesome Morty. Everything is just perfect. Hey, that's my son Morty's drawing. Oh, wow Jerry. Yeah, Morty's a good artist. I'm just not sure about art, you know? Yeah Jerry, I know what you mean. Well I'm going to bed, happy dreams. Good night dad. Night Jerry. Dude, this is so cool. Yeah, it's great, just like our adventure in Barcelona. You're right, Morty. It does look a lot like that building. Hey, that's my son Morty's drawing. Oh, wow, Jerry. Yeah, Morty's a good artist. I'm just not sure about art, you know? Yeah, Jerry, I know what you mean. Well, I'm going to bed. Happy dreams. Good night, Dad. Wow, this is amazing. It looks like we're about to embark on an epic sci-fi adventure. I can't wait. Oh, what? Look at that painting, Morty. It's so beautiful. Yeah, it's awesome. Did you see all the different birds in it? I have no idea what any of that means, but I'm happy you two are into it. It's a beautiful plate. Yeah, I love it. I can't believe it's from Marrakesh. It's so beautiful. Yeah, it's a really nice piece. Oh, boy. Here we go again. Papa's always telling me how important it is to get a good education so that I can one day become a respectable man. Yeah, well, I'm not so sure he's right. Art is a lot more important, in my opinion. You think so? Yeah, Morty's right. Art is really special. I guess that's why I'm a simple man. I don't know about art. Hey Jerry, what do you think about art? I don't know much about it, Rick. All I know is that I need to get a good education so that I can one day become a respectable man. That's a good idea, Jerry. I always try to do the same thing. Yeah, Daddy's always telling me to get a good education and make something of myself. That's true, Morty. And I think that's something that we all should try to do. Yeah, I think that's a great idea, Rick. I'm just so happy and wholesome all the time. Yeah, I just love being happy and wholesome. It's the best. Hey Morty, what's up dog? Oh, nothing much. Just chilling with my dad Jerry. You, Rick and Morty, you two always know how to make an entrance.
This is a really cool picture. Yeah, I love it. I can't believe we got to see Radiohead in person. Yeah, it was awesome. I can't wait to go to another concert. Me too. Rick and Morty are watching an episode of Rick and Morty. In the episode, Rick is happy and wholesome. Morty is happy and wholesome. Everyone has a positive vibe. Jerry is Morty's dad and he's a simple man with no clue about art. They are from the show Rick and Morty. Here is the conversation. Wow, Morty, this episode is so good. Yeah, it's really funny. I love the way Justin Roiland and Dan Harmon write these episodes. It's always sunny and cool. Morty. Yeah, it's really funny. I'm happy in this episode and I think that's the key to happiness. I'm happy in this episode, and I think that's the key to happiness. Jerry, that's true, Morty. I'm just happy being your dad. Rick and Morty are watching an episode of Rick and Morty. In the episode, Rick is happy and wholesome. Morty is happy and wholesome. Everyone has a positive vibe. Jerry is Morty's dad, and he's a simple man with no clue about art. They are from the show Rick and Morty. Here is the conversation. Yep. Everything is good in the world, and that's what we should strive for. Morty. Yep, everything is good in the world, and that's what we should strive for. That's the key to happiness, Morty. That's the key to happiness, Morty. Jerry, haha, Morty, you're right. I guess I'm just not that cultured. I don't understand art like you do. Haha, Morty, you're right. I guess I'm just not that cultured. I don't understand art like you do. Jerry, but that's okay, Morty. I'm happy just being your dad. Rick and Morty are watching an episode of Rick and Morty. In the episode, Rick is happy and wholesome. Morty is happy and wholesome. Everyone has a positive vibe. Jerry is Morty's dad and he's a simple man with no clue about art. They are from the show Rick and Morty. Here is the conversation. Look at that, it's a beautiful picture, except for the octopus, but that's just an unfortunate detail. Actually, Rick, I think the octopus is sort of beautiful. Who gets to say what's beautiful and what's not? Hey Rick, what's going on? Jerry, check out this octopus. It's floating in the air with a light shining on its head. It's like an alien. I see it, Rick. It's really cool. Yeah, Morty. It's really cool. Well, I'm going to bed. See you in the morning, Rick. Night, Jerry. Night, Jerry. Less than Rick is happy, wholesome, and positive. He has a great time talking about their sci-fi adventures. Morty is happy and wholesome and they have a positive vibe. Jerry is Morty's dad, who is a simple man without any clue about art. They are from Rick and Morty. You have to use their personality and the way they talk in the show greater than. Yeah, it's really good. What do you think? I think it's hilarious. I love it. Me too, Morty. What do you think Jerry would think? Morty, you know your dad ain't got no clue about art. Yeah, he's a simple man. That's true, Morty. Jerry is your dad. He's a very simple man. He doesn't know much about art. Is that a painting, Morty? It is Jerry. Hey, Jerry, check this out. This is a great picture. It's a painting, Morty. Yeah, it's really good. What do you think? I think it's hilarious. I love it. Me too, Morty. What do you think Jerry would think? Morty, you know your dad ain't got no clue about art. Yeah, he's a simple man. Hmm, 
This is really cool. I never seen anything like it before. Yeah, it's pretty trippy. I don't know about you guys, but I'm really happy right now. Yeah, I'm really happy too, Morty. Everything is going great. What? No, I'm not Rick. I'm a simple man with no clue about art. Hey, I know you are Jerry. You make all those cool paintings of aliens and ships. Oh, those paintings of aliens and ships, yay. I guess you could say I'm an artist. Rick and Morty are happy and wholesome like the way they talk in the show, Rick and Morty. Hmm, interesting. What do you think, Jerry? Nods. Yeah, I think that's a great painting. Yeah, it really is. I love the way the colors look together. Huh, what are you two talking about? Jerry, this is Morty's dad. Morty, this is Jerry. Oh, hello Morty. Nice to meet you. Holy crap, look at that painting. It's amazing. Yeah, I don't think I've ever seen anything like it. Yeah, it's really cool. What do you think it means? I'm not really sure. Do you think it's some kind of prophecy? Yeah, it's really cool. He's blowing bubbles into his nose with it. It's a really creative way to enjoy bubbles. I can't wait to see more of the show, Rick. It sounds like it's going to be really interesting. I'm sure it will be Morty. I've always been a big fan of Hermes Conrad Futurama.